Does your woman have daddy issues? Are you dating a girl with daddy issues? Think about her right now. What kind of relationship did she have with her dad? Was she abused by her dad, whether physically, verbally, mentally, or emotionally? Or did her dad act like she was a mistake, like he didn't want her? Or was her dad simply not around while she was growing up? If your woman's relationship with her dad resembles any of the three examples above, then I feel for you. They're not lying when they say a woman's relationship with her dad determines how well or how badly they handle relationships in the future. To be more specific, she's going to look for the love and security she didn't get from her dad in you. She'll try to get that love and security in many different ways. By being too needy or clingy. Or by being too sexually aggressive. Or by getting excessive tattoos and piercings. Or by cutting herself. Or by being a feminazi. Or by being an entitled little girl. All of that is unfair to you because you're not her dad. And even if you try to meet her unreasonable needs, you'll end up chasing a ghost. And you'll be chasing a ghost for the rest of your life, or until you give up on the relationship, or she does. I hope you see the problem you have right now. If your woman has daddy issues, your relationship is in deep trouble. But guess what? There's some good news. The good news is this. There is a way to cure a woman's daddy issues. It's called the ERP sequence, and you'll learn about it in this video. Now, fair warning, the ERP sequence isn't like anything you've heard before. In fact, it's a bit controversial in today's PC culture. That's why no one talks about it in media. But here's the inconvenient truth. The ERP sequence does cure a woman's daddy issues. Science has demonstrated it. Psychologists have used it and countless women have gotten over their daddy issues because of it. Your woman will too, and you're about to see why using this sequence on girls with daddy issues will work wonders for you. If that sounds good to you, then please leave a like to show your support. It'll only take you a moment, so do take that moment to give me a thumbs up now. I'll wait as you click the like button. Done? Awesome. Now let me tell you about the ERP sequence and what it does. When it comes to a woman's daddy issues, conventional dating advice would suggest two things. One, don't trigger her ever. And two, show her you're the best guy she could ever have. Unfortunately, conventional dating advice only sounds good, but it doesn't work because it nurtures her daddy issues. Conventional dating advice causes what's called, in psychology circles, a feedback loop. Subconsciously, she learns that her daddy issues will get her some sort of affection from you, and so her issues persist because you actively encourage them. Big oops. So what's the correct solution? The correct solution is to do the exact opposite. You are not to nurture her daddy issues, but eradicate them completely. And that's where the ERP sequence comes in. So what is the ERP sequence? The ERP sequence is a technique developed by the mentalist Derek Rake. Now, in case you've never heard of Derek before, he's the first coach to ever adapt mind control techniques into the dating world. And I'm not talking about the shady stage hypnosis kind of mind control. Instead, I'm talking about the same science used by doctors to cure phobias, PTSD, and addictions. And it's the same science that will help you cure your woman's daddy issues. Now, back to the ERP sequence. The ERP sequence is actually a combination of two mind control techniques. The first technique is called entice repel, and the second technique is called prophecy. First, let me explain entice repel. If you've ever tried a martial art like Judo or Aikido, then you'll be familiar with the entice repel concept. In Judo or Aikido, you don't use your own force to subdue your opponent. Instead, you use your opponent's own weight or momentum against him. That's why you see practitioners beat their opponents with parries and counter throws. Now, this concept is important because your woman's daddy issues are deeply ingrained in her mind. And you can't force her issues out of her. 
Instead, you'll need to entice her issues, that is, pull it slightly off balance, and then repel her issues by pushing them out of her mind, using the force of its own massive weight. You know, like a slick Steven Seagal move. I'll explain more about this with an example later in this video. Now, let me explain the second part of the ERP sequence, prophecy. Have you ever had a salesman tell you something like, if you don't buy this now, you'll regret it later on? That's prophecy, and here's why it's powerful. If you did buy his product, then he got what he wanted from you, a sale. Meanwhile, if you didn't buy his product then, and then later on, you did regret it, you'll think, yup, that salesman was right, and you'd go and buy his product. But what if you didn't buy his product, but didn't regret it later on either? Well, the salesman might have been wrong, but he's no worse off than before he met you. See the technique yet? By using the prophecy technique, the salesman put himself in a win-win situation. And so will you, when you use the prophecy technique to help your woman. In just a moment, I'll show you how these two techniques will be all you need to cure your woman's daddy issues. For now, I want you to do something for me. If you like what you've learned in this video so far, then please take two seconds to click the subscribe button below. Your support means a lot, so do become my subscriber now. I'll wait. Done? Great. Now let's move on. Here's how to use the ERP sequence on your woman. The first step is entice repel. Let's say your woman manifests her daddy issues via body modifications. She keeps getting new piercings, new tattoos, etc., and it's turning you off. So you address the problem not by talking to her about it, which will only reinforce her need to express herself. Instead, you repel her by expressing your displeasure. For example, if she proudly shows you her newest tattoo, you give a mild look of disgust and say, Okay. This will set her off for sure, but you hold your ground, doubling down and telling her, it's not personal, I just don't like tattoos. Then if she flies off the handle and threatens to break up with you, you prophesy her future. You tell her, go ahead, a lot of other men will love you, but they'll leave you. You'll see, only then will you realize what you wanted was here all along. Now, what can possibly happen? Three things. The first possible result is that she does leave you, which is a good thing by the way. You've just spared yourselves from what might have been decades of frustration. The second possible result is that she leaves you, but she realizes you are right, and so she comes back to you a changed woman. And when she does, that's when you entice her by giving her the kind of affection she needs the most. And the third possible result? She doesn't leave you at all and she strives to change her ways just so she won't lose such a great guy as you. See how the ERP sequence works? First, you show her that you're a great guy she can't afford to lose. And second, you put yourself and her in a win-win situation. That's how you cure a woman's daddy issues. No force, no coercion, no sneaky pickup tricks. Just good, old-fashioned, scientific mind control. Now, if you liked what you've learned in this video, then you'll love what's coming up next. Here's a bit of insider trivia about the ERP sequence. It's actually a modified version of an even more basic mind control technique. That mind control technique that the ERP sequence is based on is called fractionation. And when you took the time to master fractionation, you'll end up mastering the ERP sequence at the same time, as well as hundreds of other mind control techniques all of which are meant to help you achieve all your desired outcomes in love and life. And if you want to learn about fractionation, I got a sweet bonus for you. In just a moment, a link will come up inside this video. That link will take you to a special online masterclass on mind control. Your host, the master of mind control, Derek Rake himself. My advice, grab the opportunity while it's here. Click the link and join Derek's masterclass to master fractionation now. It will be the best thing that you've done for yourself all year. Trust me on this. Click the link now.